Okay, so some further thoughts on the complex oscillator here. Um, so these are your two inputs, right? Um, the beauty of modular is that anything can go anywhere. So, you know, the last video I s put pitch into the um, pitch variation, and I put the uh, sequential voltage into timbre variation, right? Um, but it can be anything. So here's a good for example. I can take pressure and assign it. So as I push down on the touchpad here, and let go, um, <clears throat> I'm using a make noise zero control, but it can be sort of whatever, right? And it can be anything that puts out CV. Here's pressure assigned to timbre. And obviously we can do, you know, pretty much anything that is assignable can be put in here. There's the pulsar, we can put envelope in here. And same thing with the pitch. is random, orange is envelope, purple is pressure, yellow is the pulsar. And then it goes without saying that you can assign, you know, different things. We would put pitch in here and pressure into there. All right, so as we go through, just, you know, food for thought, think about that every input is an input for pretty much anything. Um, and then we have an inverted section that we'll talk about later. Hope that helps.